So here at uh, Paratif Restaurant and Bar, one of the things that we have that sets us apart most definitely is a wood fire broiler with a rotisserie on the back of it. Now, the beauty of this machine is that it's not powered by gas, which uh, gas is, is definitely utilized, you know, 99% of the time in most establishments. Here we have, a, you know, this is the, as far as you can go back of cooking meats, it, it was done over a wood fire. So um, the way this thing kind of works is the, uh, the cook has a box of firewood here, and we burn oak. And uh, the first thing that his duty is to do is come in and get his fire going. So, you know, typically we'll build it across the back here, depending on if we're rotisserie. And uh, so the flames kind of shoot up into this uh, when it's revolving and we actually have proteins cooking on the back. Then the next step is he takes, uh, you know, this, this tool here is good for picking up the grates. You just go right in and pick the grates up and move them to wherever you want. And then you can actually take this whole top part and pull it forward or backward. So when he's ready to start cooking, he'll pull it back a little bit, so then that way he can manage the fire in the back too. And how we kind of do that is you don't want to cook over the direct flame that's coming out through the grill itself, but you want to uh, utilize the coals that are being made through the fire. And uh, let me just straighten this out a little bit here. And so basically there's no fire in there now, but you use this tool here to kind of grab the coals and pull them and start building a bed of fire, or uh, coals all along. And now the benefit of this is you can really, really uh, build your, your cooking zones, where if you're going to cook fish, you don't want it on really intense heat, but if you're going to sear a piece of rare meat, you're going to want to do it on the hot spot. Put, put our grill marks on it and then move it to the side and allow it to rest because the meat rests and the juices distribute and uh, you know you typically have a way juicier cut of meat that way if it's cooked controlled that way. Um, the benefit of using uh, wood fire versus gas is you have a more natural flavor and sometimes when you use gas you can taste that it was cooked on gas. Um, so this is a more natural way of cooking. It's a natural flavor, and one of the biggest bonuses is it imparts a little bit of smoke into the meat. So you have a little smoky flavor as well. And the you know with the rotisserie in the back, you get the same effect because a lot of smoke just keeps barreling in this. It kind of circulates through our uh, hood system here, and it just kind of swirls in here as the fire goes, and it imparts a lot of flavor into whatever we're cooking on the rotisserie and the grill itself. And uh, we have several things that, that, that get cooked on the grill. We have pork chops, our turkey porterhouse, uh, hanger steaks, uh, swordfish, tuna, several different kebabs that we do and stuff. And, and it's it's really flavorful. This this grill is, you know, even more so than a charcoal, the wood fire, you know, it, 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 you can, it allows you to control your heat very, very, very well. And, uh, and you get a lot of smokiness into the food as well. So.